It's been a testing year for Mark, trying to develop this minor 10 AUXR8. He needs a good result here at the FAI 1000, and the weekend has started perfectly for him. He was fourth quickest in qualifying yesterday, and he's in the top 10 shootout for the second time. Former Australian Formula 4 champion Mark Larkin, now 35 years of age, born and raised in Sydney, lives up on the Gold Coast where he has his team set up there, setting up his own operation for 2000 where he'll be a very separate entity from the Stone Brothers Ford team. Comes up towards speed stick turn. Former Australian Formula Ford champion, two times Australian drivers champion. Car with enormous amount of experience. Had a difficult introduction to V8 supercar racing, trying to go his own way. A pretty radically developed car, didn't work out for him. But now got a package that's working very, very well and always toward this end of the year, Lee, he starts to get his act together. Last year he won at the uh, Honda Indy 300 on the Gold Coast and that set him up, wound him up for the Enduros. He was very unlucky not to finish on the podium last year. He and Brad Jones, what can Larkin do this year? You can see there, wasn't pushing as high, as hard as Mark Scaife was. A brilliant lap of a 209.57 will be tough for Larkin to beat. He will be pleased just to be in this top ten. Fantastic shot from our cherry picker high above Mount Panorama. Oh, tough the smoke there. He sets the car up for the elbow. Not an easy task. 1,350 kilograms of Aussie V8. And this is a pretty quick time too. Check, checked on the split. 23 threes, about half a second. To Jason Bright's time with the split, so this could be another nine. And it's the same, it was the same split as Craig Lowndes. So Larkham in the minor 10 Ford looking the goods through Challenge Chase. One of four Fords at the top of the tree. Will they stay there at the end of the top 10 shootout under the Dunlop Bridge? One corner remaining for Mark Larkham, the Queenslander, for the second year in a row, teaming with Brad Jones. The run to the line of 209.57 is the time to beat. Larkham has done it!